Well, here I am in the never-ending stupid forest of ugly snakes. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. You know, I kind of hate this game. I don't know if that's politically incorrect to say. I kind of hate Bloodborne. It's just like every area looks exactly the same. There's no way to tell where you're going. I got so lost in this stupid forest. I wandered around here for hours. Because I couldn't even find where the boss was. There's like no... clear path. There's no indicators of where I am. I don't like it. But anyways... Hi. Welcome to another episode of me playing Bloodborne. Um, I'm trying to finally beat this game. I don't hate the game. It's okay. But I'm trying to finally beat it because Dark Souls 3 is coming out, and the last thing I need is to be, like, juggling two games that I have to beat. It's fucking impossible for me to find the time to even beat one game anymore. But, uh, anyways, yeah, I wandered around this godforsaken forest for, for a thousand years. Let's just fast forward a bit. Yeah, that's more like it. All right, here we go. Now I'm at full power. Now I'm at full speed. My my speed has increased a thousand fold. I've ascended. I've been training in 500 times gravity, and now I'm quicker than lightning. I've achieved my Bankai. My Zangetsu has allowed me to move at superhuman speed with superhuman reflexes. The human eye can barely even keep up with my movements. I, I can't even see their movements, Pickle Dick! I know, Vegeta, they're so fucking fast! It really is just way more fun to just pretend that, like, this is the normal speed of the game. God, this stupid pile of snakes! It's a rape snake, and I've had it up to here with this crap! I've had it with all of them! I've had it with these motherfucking snakes! IN MY MOTHERFUCKING FOREST! And thank God that I'm so quick on my feet now. Thank God I'm quicker than greased lightning! And I finally have the power, the speed, the reflexes, the dexterity to chop every stupid looking goofy snake I see into a million dumb idiot gay faggy faggo fag pieces and cook them up at a barbecue. I am Sonic Hedgehog speed! As fast as Sonic the Hedgehog, possibly even faster. I don't know, I'd have to check with the authorities. I'd have to look it up in the Encyclopedia Britannica of Fast Things. Jesus Christ, is this, is this still going? Anyways, as you can see, I got killed by those weird-looking big head guys. Those glow-in-the-dark slow mutants with their stupid laser light show. Crawling around the bottom of the fucking canyon. Fucking around in the grass, just like snakes, you know? They're just- they're all just like snakes. Everyone in this game is a bunch of snakes in the grass. Including the literal snakes. But metaphorically speaking, also the werewolf guys and the stupid big-headed glowy motherfuckers. Hmm. Okay, I guess we- I guess we don't have to watch all of this. It's, it's like, even on like- like ten times normal speed. Like, I'm going, like, Barry Allen, Wally West speed right now. I'm traveling at the speed of the fucking speed force. I'm going 10 trillion miles an at a second. And it's still taking me forever. That's how, how much of a ridiculous labyrinth this gay forest is. Ah, Jesus. It's just... It just keeps going and going. Listen to the pitter-patter on my little feet. It's kind of cute. <laughs> yeah, alright. Okay, enough of this! I'm skipping it! Alright. Look at this shit. Look at how good I am at this game. Watch me effortlessly destroy these ugly, stupid, dumb shit snake piles. See, I just wrecked that guy, but watch this. Watch the, the skill that goes into this expert takedown. Dodging his stupid poison spray. Shoot him. Shoot him. Dodge him. Dodge his stupid poison. Shoot him. Shoot him. Dodge. <laughs> I'm so fucking cool. I'm so smart. I'm so crafty. Oh, but I ran out of bullets. But that's okay. Because I've still got a sword. And I'm gonna run up on him. 
dodging more of his stupid poison. That one hit me, but that's okay. He got lucky. That was a fluke. It happens sometimes. I'm still the best there's ever been, okay? Even the best get hit by poison sometimes. Doesn't mean anything bad about my skills. I'm the greatest of all time. You saw the skill and speed and dexterity and reflexes of dodging the poison, shooting him, and then I, you see I just fucking stabbed him right in his stupid snakely, squiddly spooch. And then I fucking wandered around the forest for like five more hours. I'm so fucking lost in this forest. This forest sucks. This game sucks. He's a big pig. You could be a big pig too. This guy sucks. I hate this loser. Nobody's cool in this game. There's no Solaire. There's no, like, Siegfried. Everyone's a fucking loser. All these guys are geeks. I hate them. This guy looks like the Black Knight from Monty Python. And I just fucking fought the Monty Python, too. You saw me kill it. You saw me slay it. I slayed the Monty Python! So I started recording here just because I was so um, impressed, I guess, at how beautiful the scenery is. And look at this place. This scenic lakeside manor. And me, the most beautiful guy of all in my... in my fucking bloody dead man garb. I'm the bloody dead man. I gained my power from the moon. Oh, here comes some Jeff Goldblooms. Wreck my party. Roll away from those guys. Why am I running away? Turn around and fight them, you pussy. There we go. Fuck you. Get out of here, Jeff Goldblum. You ain't shit. You get out of here. Killed him. I killed both of the Jeff Goldblums. But there's always more Jeff Goldblums, you know. You, Jeff Goldblum can never truly die. He's too powerful. Look at this moonlit motherfucker. Like, what even is this? Like, a giant brine shrimp? A fucking... A radiated sea monkey that grew to kaiju proportions? Is that what I'm fighting here? What a piece of shit. Oh, this guy pissed me right off. I think I fought this guy, like, four times. He just fucking raped me every time. With his gay little magic and his stupid little... Octopus tentacles. Okay. Okay, here I am again. I'm coming up the stairs. You can see my, my blood echoes are over there. I fucking run right past them because I'm an idiot. And I'm coming up the stairs and I'm gonna fight this asshole again. Ah, oh, Jesus. Look at the look at that. Ah, oh, God. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed and I'm ashamed. But I'm not ashamed because it's not my fault. It's clearly the game's fault. It's clearly not fairly designed. It's it's, it's a piece of shit. How many times did I fight this guy? I think I fought him four times, at least. This time I get my blood echoes. Now that, I, now that I have none to get, that's when I pick them up. That's when I remember to pick them up, when I had none anyway. So now I finally got this asshole on the ropes, this fucking alabaster anus. That's his name. He's the Alabaster Anus of Moonlit Meadow. That's his full rank and title. See, I'm just raping him right now. I'm doing good this time. But of course, watch him pull some cheap trick out of his ass. Ah, Jesus. I've almost got him dead. He's almost dead. He's right there. Of course. What a piece of shit. Trying to shoot his stupid magic at me. Not this time. No way, Jose. You goofy looking bastard with your stupid white coat like you're some kind of gay scientist. Nothing against the gays, but just against this guy, this gay in particular. Now he's dead. Take that, you stupid asshole. Take your stupid elixir. Take my stupid blood echoes. You stupid idiot. Ring my ding. And suck my dong. You can't unring that bell. The dong has been dung. Look at this idiot that I summoned. 
This guy thinks he can help me fight. He's got a fucking birdcage on his head. Here's Father McMurphy trying to touch me in an inappropriate place. Gotta hell, you old bastard. I don't know if you're supposed to kill this guy, but I killed him. Ah, I shit my pants. And he died shitting his pants. Truly the fate that awaits all of us. But not me, because I'm going to commit suicide by leaping off the beautiful balcony. Nope, I, I guess not. I guess I turned around for some reason. Like an idiot. Okay, now, now I'm gonna... Okay. I'm admiring the moon once more. It is a beautiful game. Howl at the moon, baby. Howl at the moon. Dive into the water. And now, here I am. Getting ready to fight Dark Link. I'll just whip out my Goron hammer. Make quick work of that fool. And here's this big blubbering hemorrhoid. Rom, the vacuous bunghole. Look at this hideous freak. It's a face only a toilet could love. It's probably why he lives in a giant toilet. This guy's a big turd. He's like a turd with its own asshole. When the moon is red, I go blind, because it's killing time. When the moon is red, I lose my mind, because it's killing time. <laughs> That's a little classic Shaggy 2 dope for ya. I am a musical connoisseur, if ever there was one. Woo! Look at that. Look at that. Look at this place. It's beautiful. That red-ass moon shining in the sky like a baboon's booty.